Yo, what's up, Earth? My name's Cody Masters. I'm a rock singer-songwriter from Boston, Massachusetts. This is Five Questions with Cody Masters. Um, growing up, I was a big fan of bands like MXPX, um, Operation Ivy. I really like this band called The Matches, Say Anything. I also really like the singer-songwriters Ryan Adams, Allison Weiss. Ben Queller, it's a laundry list. I would consider my style like uh, kind of like a mix between singer songwriter pop and pop punk. So bands like Newfound Glory, um, Midtown, and even like older stuff like Paul Simon and Billy Joel. All that stuff really had an influence on what I was doing when I first started playing music. And those are a lot of the same artists I look to for inspiration today. Yeah, it would probably be that I'd be writer, or I am a writer. I guess I'm like a songwriter and a writer. I'm going to my senior year at Emerson College, and I'm majoring in writing, literature, and publishing. English major rock, so I guess if I wasn't writing songs, I'd be doing other writery things. A lot of people ask me about my clothes, like especially my signature hat, the steampunk goggles. Um, I actually don't know that much about steampunk. <gasps> Grew up in the theater. My parents ran a production company when I was younger. They wrote and produced plays, musicals, and straight dramas. So I've come straight from school to rehearsal. You know, I've been watching plays get put up from start to strike and, and doing my homework while my mother was directing actors and the whole aesthetic of theater really had an influence on me. So I try to give my audience a bit more than just jeans and t-shirt rock. Um, you know, I love a thrift store junkie. I also brought my little brother's closet from time to time and I guess my style is just an amalgamation of all those things. Uh, I appreciate, you know, uh, Lots of letters and stuff I get talking about steampunk and whatnot, but I really consider my style a derivation of that, which I call steampunk. So, yeah. If you want to follow up to the Goodies Mixtape, I'm going to release a new EP sometime between now and the end of the year. Uh, as far as what we can expect from it sonically, well, uh, it's definitely going to have songs on it. Uh, I only really started working on the EP um, sometime last month. I've got a ton of songs picked out, but I haven't really narrowed it down to the final track listing. So I'm going to be recording it at the Emerson College Recording Studio sometime uh, first semester of next year. And I'll be keeping you all posted with video updates and hopefully a new track uh, sometime in the next few months. Yeah, I'd like to do more videos, uh, more music videos in particular. I really had a lot of fun shooting this Speak Too Soon music video. It's gotten a really positive reaction. If you haven't seen it, check it out. It's on my channel. Do me a solid and repost it if you like it. Um, I've been talking to the dude who directed that one. His name's Alex Walder. He's a really good guy. If you get an opportunity, you should check out his YouTube channel, The Dylan Hall. And we're thinking we're going to do another video for Art Imitates Wife. So. The Art of the Wife video is in the earliest stages right now. I can't really tell you too much about it, except that it's going to be awesome and that it will likely take place in the library. Or library, if you prefer. So expect more news about that sometime between now and the end of the summer. Thanks a lot for watching. This has been Five Questions with Cody Masters. If you have any further questions, hit me up on Twitter, Facebook, message me on YouTube. I'm 100% available. That's just hotline. I don't know the number off the top of my head, so when I edit this video, I'll just run it all on the screen. Right here. Yeah. Okay. Then when taking flight, we only fly by night. While I'm pushing you right down these anthems. Slight of figure, and she's fond of sleight of hand.